What's up everybody, my name is Boinkle J. Zimmer, back with a whole new video. In this video, we are continuing and possibly finishing South Park Stick of Truth. As a reminder, um, as a reminder, this is a South Park game, meaning all of it's inappropriate. Without further ado, let's get going. You could conquer the Fortress of Darkness. Clyde, back away from that stuff. Oh, but I have yet to complete my army. You have come to witness the power of darkness. Stop! Clyde, you have no idea what that stuff is. Yeah, it's green sauce from Taco Bell. I took it from their construction site. Dude, that's not Taco Bell sauce. Then why'd I find it at the Taco Bell? It leaked out of a UFO, Clyde. It's toxic goo from another galaxy. Think about it. Since when does Taco Bell have a green sauce, dude? Actually, since about a year ago. What? Taco Bell has green sauce now. No way. They've had it longer than a year. I've always gotten spicy green burritos. Yeah, no, I'm saying in the packets. They just started putting green sauce in packets. The fuck? How the fuck did I miss it? Ha ha! I don't seem so foolish now, do I? That doesn't mean you have Taco Bell green sauce, dip fuck. Yeah, Clyde, why do you think that shit's glowing? Maybe because of the three varieties of chili peppers. Just give us a stick, asshole. Or what? You'll beat me up? Ha ha! I've got another surprise for you. I'm going to make love to you, woman. Ah! Get him, Commander Douchebag! Time to fight Chef. This all makes sweet love. All right. Don't forget to tip your serving winch. By the moon and the stars in the skies, I swear we will you have to do better than that. All right. I did not want that one. <laughs> Children, what have I done? You tried to eat us, Chef. All right. Hey, I raised you from the dead. You have to obey. <laughs> obey me. In high zoom. In high zoom. 
I did not mean to give that to me. Whoops. Because I was the last person who needs it. By the hammer of letters! I just... We'll see if it works! better. My dad, I mean, my slaves built it, and my slaves built it. We almost got him now. Children, what have I done? He's fighting it. Chef, this isn't you. God damn. Children, everybody, I'm back. Enough of this. Your eons of torment are at an end, ruler of darkness. Uh, okay, um, you know what? I'm not playing anymore. You have broken the rules of the stick, and for that, I banish thee. I banish thee from space and time. Ah! <laughs> we did it, dude. That was awesome. You did it. Your noble quest is at an end. And for all your deeds and all your time put into this, I hereby promote you to King Douchebag. Congratulations! <laughs> King Douchebag. King Douchebag? Is that what you told them your name was? Why didn't you tell them your real name, Dovakin? You don't remember, do you? How we tried to find you? Look, that stick belongs with the Fighters of Zaron. Give it back. Fighters of Zaron? Boys, what's going on here is much more complex than that. This isn't the first time a UFO has crashed to Earth. You see, in 1947, a UFO crashed in Roswell, New Mexico. 
Oh, God. Pop, rather spare us. Hang on a sec. A UFO crashed in Roswell, and a new government agency was created to investigate the paranormal. Our agency. Can we skip this? Like, hit the skip button or something? Oh, you don't want to skip this. Yes, we do. Whenever aliens are spotted, vampires run amok, our agency is there, and we have never lost a fight. That is, until four years ago when we investigated a child. Yawn, yawn, yawn. A child who had an unnatural power inside him. I had orders from the president to secure the child so that we could harness his powers before our enemies could. But he slipped through our hands. The government wants the new kid for his farts? That's dumb. His farts? No. His amazing ability to make friends so quickly on any social network. Before he was five years old, he had 3.2 billion friends on Facebook alone. Do you have any idea the power that kind of gift yields in today's world? It's time to come with us, Dovahkiin. Time to stop resisting and use your gift for your country. Is he really still talking? Are we so different, you and I, Dovahkiin? Uh... You have to do what the government tells you to do, just like me. We're all just pawns in their game. I'll admit you are fascinating. You have more power than any child I've ever come across, and yet all you seem to really care about is this. It must be very important. What does it do? Whoever controls the stick controls the universe, dumbass. Yeah, stupid. Controls the... But then... I wouldn't have to do what I was told anymore. I could... <laughs> I control the universe! Get back! Back, I say, all of you! I can do anything! Anything I want! <laughs> I no longer need you, new kid! I control the universe! Ah! Uh -huh. uh, uh, damn thing! How does it work? Show me how it works! Yeah, right. Dovahkiin, why should we be on the opposite sides? Join me, Dovahkiin. Rule by my side. Rule. And you can have this all to yourself forever. I can offer you all! Just get me safely out of here! You can rule with this once again! You underestimated the character of the fighters of Zaron. What binds us is more than that relic. And you failed to recognize the character of our alliance. Yes, and that friendship is more important to any of us than even the stick of truth. Dude, where are you going? <laughs> Princess Kenny! At least one of you has some sense. You'd sell us all out? But why, Princess Kenny? Because Princess Kinney was born a half-orc, whose entire village was wiped out by humans and elves. Morgan Freeman? You see, when humans and elves lived together in the forest of Hollow Falls, an elven queen fell in love with the orc known as Dandar, the first one to possess the Stick of Truth. They loved in secret and had a child. A beautiful little girl, a girl who watched as everyone she loved was killed in cold blood. And that is why she waited and plotted all this time to take the stick from you. For Princess Kinney is true heir to the stick of truth. Wow, that's pretty cute. Just one thing, Morgan Freeman. How come every time something convoluted needs explaining, you show up? Because every time I show up and explain something, I earn a freckle. <coughs> uh -huh, uh -huh. Princess Kinney, come back here! And stop it. <laughs> all right. We're just gonna buy out everything because this is gonna be the last fight.
I can't with this music. There we go. It's all over, Princess Kenny. Douchebag is too powerful for you. What's she doing? No, Kenny, don't drink that! Hit them with the zombie vomit! Of tricks up her puppy sleeves. Hey, fellas. Ow, I hurt my leg. You better go on without me. Use your 
your Ooh. rainbow attack, Princess Guinea! Here's a little ditty that'll make your pants shitty. <laughs> Get him up and knock him down. Hit them with the zombie vomit. All right. Give these vermin a taste of their own medicine, Princess Guinea. No, where are you going with Princess Kitty's rat? Damn you! <laughs> We knew Feel it. The is dead. Death comes for you, Dragonborn. You'd better pray for a miracle. Oh, hamburgers! <laughs> Foolish Princess Kitty. Do you not know that death is a servant of chaos? By her tits. Where's my revive? Make me proud, King Douchebag. I 
Only one damage got taken Hit out of that. The zombie vomit. I got your back, yo. Death comes for you, Dragonborn. You'd better pray for a miracle. <laughs> Foolish princess kitty. Do you not know that death is a servant of chaos? How can this be? I am Stan Marshwalker, brother of wolves and badgers. Well, that chaos energy is making me a little woozy. All right. I win. Oh my god, you killed Kitty. Yeah, that. Oh, no way, he's back. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Kitty. She looks more dead than she was before. I kill her again. Princess is magic. It's so pretty. Hit them with the zombie vomit! Darn, I was trying to do like a burning time too. For the fate of humanity! Huh. Alright, Dicko, time for you to pay. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Kitty! God damn it now! Finish these weaklings, Princess Kinney! Fucking goddamn, you asshole! Death tag! Ginger! Fuck you! Boy skin! Bull crap! Not very cute! Asshole! Get face fucked and you to get faster! Alright. 
We're gonna make you go on flame again. Hit them with the zombie vomit! Immune, damn it. There we go. Use your rainbow attack, Princess. Are you kidding me? It didn't let me do anything, but cool. Not letting me block it. I don't need Cartman. Pick her ass, back, do it. They're still gonna be on fire, I don't care. Hit them with the zombie vomit! There we go. Are you kidding me? She doesn't stay dead. We can't beat her. Two, we're fucked. There's no way. There is one way. 
We're gonna have to break the gentleman's code. What? Cartman, you can't possibly mean... What other choice do we have, Cal? King Douchebag, you remember long ago, I made you swear an oath to never fart on anyone's boss. I am now asking you to break that oath. He's right, it's our only chance. Fart on Princess Kitty's boss, King Douchebag! Do it! Now, King Douchebag, fart on Princess Kitty's boss! What about the gentleman's oath? That princess is a stone cold bitch. You have to do it now. Forget what you swore. No. Princess Kenny's balls are exposed. This can't be. What? We're back to normal. We're, we're cured! You're all better now, Daddy. That's right, son. The Dragonborn must have farted on a princess's balls. You guys sure about this? There's no other way. It drove our friend to madness and nearly killed us all. So what do you guys want to play now? How about dinosaur hunters? Or pharaohs and mummies? Let's ask Douchebag. What do you want to play next, dude? Oh my god, it's time, it's time. I love this part. Screw you guys. I'm going home. <laughs> wow, what a dick. All right. Well, I don't get my next game until Wednesday, and that's Final Fantasy Crisis Core, obviously. So I think we're going to do one more part to uh, South Park, but that will be a stream uh, where we'll be just doing a bunch of the uh, side objectives. And then after that, we'll be, because we don't have time for another game since I get Crisis Core on Wednesday, we'll be doing Dreamlight Valley until that point. See y'all in the next one. Bye-bye.